Crazy Island Studios. Um, I wasn't going to record today. It's Saturday. And I didn't put on any makeup or do my hair. I like... Excuse my noisy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I brushed it. That's as good as it gets. I brushed my teeth. Does that count as like getting ready? Because, yeah, it's supposed to be a lazy day. My husband's back is really bothering him. So, he's resting. So, I'm just kind of hanging out today. Um... And I wasn't going to record, but then I had to go to the post office. I had to. And there was Happy Mail. Um, I have been waiting for a book from Letha. Those of you on Crazy Island Family Facebook group probably know who Letha is. And I have been waiting impatiently. Well, I tried to be patient at first, and then I got a little impatient. Waiting for her to send me... I'm trying to move things around while I'm talking. I'm being so distracted. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, I've been waiting for a book that she was sending me. And I knew she was sending it. It's a fairy book. It's Miss Coddington's... Right, I always forget the name of the book. Fairy book? It might just be fairy book. I don't know. Or book of fairies. Um, but she sent it to me a while back. And I never got it, never got it, never got it. And I never got a notice that it was at the post office. And so finally, I after my last mail haul because I was concerned that it was lost she looked it up and, and checked on it at my post office and they were able to find it and the problem is they marked it 5933 my post office box is 5953 so this was sitting with a card in somebody else's mailbox this is sitting in the back because my P.O. box is not big enough for this ginormous package so it was sitting somewhere else waiting for someone to pick it up and thankfully 5933 never went to check their mail and got the card and took my package home because I would have been really sad. I would have been really sad if they stole so, it. Um, Oliver, you can see I've cracked it open. That's all I've done is start opening these. I promised I would open this in front of her. But look at this cool envelope that she did. I mean it's just a white packing envelope but she put washi tape all over it and made it super cool. And Instead of doing just like the regular printed postage, be just like her daughter, she sent me all kinds of cool stamps instead. Their post office wasn't busy, so she talked them into doing all of the postage by stamp instead of little pre-printed sticker. How cool is that? So I have her address covered up, but I'll show you. But you love her little minions on her address return label. So cute. And then on the back it says happy mail and there's all the washi tape. I don't know that I'll be able to save much of this. There's oh well maybe. Ooh. I thought there was plastic over or uh, plastic tape over all of it, but there's not. I might be able to save some of this and use it again. Yepers. So I have happy mail from Lisa, which I'll open in a minute. And I also got a box from Miss Gina Aarons. I have just opened it, but as you can see, this is as far as I've gotten. I haven't opened it up and looked inside. I was just cutting the tape. It's like jammed packed full because the tape was like starting to buckle trying to get loose because it's so full. But first, and let me peel off this horrible ugly post office sticker that they stuck on there and mess it up. I had a postcard from Yvonne today from Australia. Yay! Yeah, I like it. I like it. So anyways, cool. I love it. I was reading it real quick. I'm, I'm so going to read the rest of it in a minute. But I love the postcard. I love the little map. It's so cute. It's so cute. I like it. Thank you so much, Yvonne, for sending me that. Okay. So, on to Letha's. What was that noise? I don't know what that noise was. Package. I want to show you the book. I'm so excited about the book. I almost pulled the book out just to see it, but I contained myself so that I could... Ah, Ah, do the unveiling. She wasn't kidding. I told her it feels like there's a little more than a book in this package. And she said, oh yeah, well the envelope wasn't full. And then she had to have help getting it to get the tape around it. I don't blame her because the book doesn't want to come out. It's like packed in there tight. Oh my gosh. Lady Coddington's pressed fairy book. That is the word I'm looking for. This is hilarious. Do you see how pretty the pictures are? But they're kind of funny at the same time. Uh-oh. Oh, she's sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. Look, there's Happy Mail right inside the book. Oh, my God. A mess of stickers. Like a whole mess. Of, oh, look at all the butterflies. Oh, look at these. Fun. 
These are so cool. I'm up. I'm showing them to you upside down. That's not helpful. Wow. And then more. There's upside down too. They're upside down too. You want to look at upside down bridge? I don't know. I'm upside down. Oh, oh, oh! Look, that's money. I'm so excited. So cool. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So sneaky happy mail set aside. I'm burying my phone. I should not do that. Here is, okay, this is the picture that they show on the Amazon that I just think is, it's hilarious. The poor little fairy is smashed in the book, but then it's all watercolory and dreamy at the same time. It's just beautiful at the same time. It, it's so cool. Look, look, this one, this one almost got away. Like a feet. And so basically, it's like a... Uh, Let's just look through it. It's it's like a scrapbook written out by whoever was catching these fairies. Probably Lady Coddington, right? So there's a whole lot in here, but I won't go through all of it. But I mean, it's like she's writing her notes about catching the fairy. So like, it's so hard to see what I'm doing. So look at her expression. Is it great? But the photo itself, or the picture drawing watercolor itself, is still just gorgeous. And then there's always this impression on the other side. Look at that. Like she was juicy. It <laughs> just cracks me up. So they're gorgeous, gorgeous pictures and just so fun at the same time. Look at these. These are fantastic. So I cannot wait to go through this entire book. Like these, they're incredible. It's so fun. So fun. Thank you, Letha. I can't tell you how much. I'm so glad you had a second copy sitting around your house so that you could send it to me because I love fairies. Fairies and butterflies. Man, I love fairies and butterflies. And so I got fairies. Okay. You don't send little bits, do you? You send big bits. Wow. So this is like a whole set of chipboard stickers. How cute. And they're all like fairies. Fairy tales. Oh, I like, I like. Nice. Once upon a time and all that good stuff. <gasps> so cool. Ooh, look at these. These are pretty. Nice. That's so cool. Okay. And then, <laughs> some cute little Shih Tzu Sticker stickers from Jolie's Boutique. This makes me think that you believe that my little Molly dog is a Shih Tzu. She might be part Shih Tzu. I know she's not 100% because her eyes don't do that little buggy outy thing that Shih Tzu eyes do. She might be. I was thinking Pekingese and Maltese. But she's got a little bit of that Shih Tzu look to her, doesn't she? she who knows what she is? We don't care. She's a Molly pup and we just love her to pieces. So... Ooh, these are cute little puffy stickers. They call them dome stickers. Is that the fancy name for grown-ups? Because when I was a kid, they were puffy stickers. And in my world, they're still puffy stickers. Puffy stickers. Oh, mm. These are not puffy. These are downright rigid, like hard acrylic stickers. These are pretty. Look at those. I got some goodness going on here. Someone called about something. No, that's fine. That's like my messages, well, my husband's messages to me. Someone called about something, and you should call him back. But cute little posty notes that say that. A whole stack. Like, I have notepads. Now, if y'all see notes coming for me for that or stuck everywhere, don't be surprised. Don't be surprised. Oh, cool beans. More postcards from Wyoming. Oh, look. Wyoming air fresheners. <laughs> That's so funny. That is adorable. Oh, and looky here. Mm -hmm. I guess the boys are kind of nice in Wyoming, too. Yeah, we got some good buns. I don't know what my husband's going to think about that postcard, but he doesn't have to see it right away now, does he? <laughs> We'll just, we'll, just, we'll just keep that one aside for me. She sent me a little sticky note that says, just for fun. That was fun. That was fun. Okay. Ooh, an envelope with my name on it. An envelope with my name on it. And pretty little decoration. Look at little washi tapes. Okay. Let's see. I don't know if this is personal or if this is 
just little doodad stuffs or what, but I apparently can't open an envelope. There we go. Oh, no. It's a beautiful card. Hang on. Totally. We are totally friends. <gasps> How cute is this? Okay. Okay, I'm ready now. Look at this beautiful card she made me. I want to get you, I want you to get all of it. Oh, it's so pretty. So pretty. Look at, look at. Oh, it says have a nice day. Oh, it says have a great day. I can't read backwards. Oh, she did the back too. I'm always like surprised by you guys. You guys surprise me at every turn. Look at how beautiful that tag is. Yep, y'all do. You surprise me. I'm kind of naive, so I'm easy to surprise. Okay, so beautiful card. Thank you so much. I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. There's still more, but I just got to the card. I just found it. <gasps> oh my goodness gracious. This could be super fun. Okay, once upon a time, it's the same like theme and coordinates with these once upon a times. Chipboard shapes and letters. A whole box. A whole box of them. How do I get into the box? I don't know how to work the box. What am I doing wrong here? Oh. Well, there's tape. That's the prop. There's tape. That's what I'm doing wrong. Sometimes, yeah, I'm a little, um, hmm. I'm not always the quickest, you know. Not always. I'll admit, not always the smartest cookie to look for the tape. Okay, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Almost. Ooh, I got it open. Okay. I don't know. Oh, there's like castle shape. There's like all kinds of kookiness in here. All kinds of kookiness. Look. Oh my goodness, there's a sword. How fun is that? There's just all kinds of goodness in the box. All kinds of goodness. Okay. Maybe I should put the tape back on it. What have we got here? What? Oh my goodness. Letha, you are going to hate me in a minute because, um, yeah, well, well, we'll just go over that in a second. She sent me napkins! So basically, I'm getting a, <laughs> look at these prints. How cute. I love, these ones are big. I think these are like, what are they called? Guest towels? So you can put them. Ooh. These are like the ones I got. So if you see someone else with these, know that I, I have bought some too. We shop in the same places. You can't, I'll, you can't have too many. It's okay. <gasps> Ooh, look at that one. I want to show you vert sideways, but they go vertically, and I love the little trees. And then these ones, and that's only one stack. So why are you going to hate me, Letha? I'm going to tell you, because I am in the midst of coordinating a napkin swap. So you just sent me all your napkins. I hope you have more. I hope you have more and you could be in the swap. But this is what it's going to be like for y'all who join the swap. You are going to get to open packages of napkins. Oh my gosh, I love this one. I love so many. Look at that. Not colors I use traditionally, but I love the look of it so I will figure out how to use those colors. That's so much fun. Look at all these pretty patterns. Oh, look, I'm ready for Christmas. Heck yeah. You must already have a bit of a napkin um, problem because you have a lot of patterns. <gasps> look at that one. You have a lot of patterns. Look at those cool little quilty birds. Oh, I like, I like. That's not all. That's not all. I have napkins for days now. Check this out. There's more. Are these napkins too? Are these Kleenexes? <gasps> you could... Okay, y'all, printed tissues, it looks like. No, these are bigger than a Kleenex. Right? No, these are Kleenex. Tissues. Um, I don't know if y'all have Kleenex everywhere all over the world, but these look like those little pocket tissues. I never even thought about those. These come in all kinds of fun prints, too. So now y'all know. Pocket tissues. That would work, too. That would work, too. Okay, look at that. Ooh, blue and brown. I love turquoise on brown. Like, super cool. And as a nice solid. That would actually go with that other one. And some more fall. 
More fall, more fall. Oh, there's more. Oh, look at the edge. Oh, I like that. What a pretty leaf. Oh, I like this pattern. Oh, those are cool flowers. More. Ooh, I went too fast. More flowers. These are cute on both sides. And roses. And forget me nots. I only know this because they're labeled as forget me not. <laughs> so I would not know otherwise girl after my own heart. Look at that. Now that's something I would paint. I like it. I like it. Oh, look at this cute butterfly. All retro looking. And some more quilty bird in a different pattern. Okay. That is a big honking mess of napkins. That is so fun. That is so fun. Um, I am going to have to devise some napkin storage. Right now I'm using the bottom bin of my Ikea craft, Rascog craft cart and um, mostly because I have a hard time bending because of my back reaching all the way to the bottom so it seemed like a good place to store stuff that I will use but not terribly often. So that's where my napkins are all at right now. So I don't have a lot of room, my shelves are full and I keep getting things and buying things so napkin storage is going to be top of my list because we are doing a napkin swap. The closer towards the end of this month it'll be um, actually happening but we'll be posting an announcement probably on Monday or Tuesday so um, I have a head start thank you Letha very very much for everything I love all of it I can't wait to sit down and read that entire book because I will read all the fun little stories that I'm sure it says because if they have pictures of fairies with their faces all wonky and all smashed the, the story about how they were caught has got to be hilarious so I am very much looking forward to going through that and checking it out so thank you so much for everything that was very very generous of you and I hope you have some napkins left so that you can do excuse my itchy nose um, I hope you have some napkins left so that you can participate in the napkin swap because I think I got a lot of them. Napkins come in such big packs like 20 and 30 and 40 packs. Like To share them is great. I, I would share a 10 pack just to get rid of half because what are you going to do the same pattern over and over again? I think it's a good idea. Napkin and tissue paper. Printed tissue paper. Not plain or colored. Just like prints of tissue paper and printed napkins. We're going to do a swap. So look forward to that. Uh, I'm working it out. I have Stacy who's helping me head this one up because Nadine is going to be my official ATC swap girl for now because she volunteered and I, I'm all for it. Um, she wants to do one every few months which I think is a good idea and also um, napkin swap coming up and then another swap coming up that I will wait and let you, Miss Gina tell you about. Miss Gina Arians who sent me this box. I know I'm flashing her address but she told me it's okay because it's a P.O. box even though it doesn't look like one. So something is taped. Oh it's just, uh oh. The tape, uh, the glue on the inside of the box has gotten a hold of a couple of things. Let me get them loose. Thankfully, this is wrapped in plastic, so, because it's, it's stuck, and maybe that's why you put it there, but this does not want to come loose. Maybe I'll leave the plastic to protect everything else, and I'll pull out the art. Oh, <gasps> look at that. Gina sent me another piece of her art, another one of a kind, Gina Aaron's artwork. Again, I like this. It's so abstracty and oh, I like it. It says, Faith is the bird that feels the light when the dawn is still dark. That's pretty good. Pretty good quote, but I love the painting. Thank you so much, Gina. Um, I got some stuff. I got a. This box is bursting. This little box is bursting with lots of little stuffs. I'm praying you didn't cut these things out with your one hand because this is little, little, little butterfly, uh, ladybug. Oh, I know what these are because I see the stamp on the back. These are out of her um, envelopes that she does fun little things with her envelopes that she saves and uses them and repurposes them. And she does doodles and stuff on them. This is another one. So smart. Like, you don't waste anything. This is so cute. This is so cute. I love that. 
Oh my goodness. She's like being crazy generous with the artwork now. Look at this. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Like, that's pretty cool. I really like that. I'm so excited for the next thing. What's next? What's next? What's next? Oh, it's a, one of our cute little pictures beginning. These little Instagram pictures printed up. Or the square pictures like Instagram. I have no idea which direction specifically. I believe this way the flower goes. I'm assuming this is one of her photographs taken on one of her walks. Because she takes some beautiful spring photographs right now. Of things that she finds when she walks. Because she's a good girl and she goes on walks. Oh, oh. So, to feed my butterfly and fairy addiction, I got a whole packet of fun transparency butterflies from Kane Company. Kane Company is one of my favoriteest, favoriteest. They have some of the prettiest stuff. Oh, like everybody goes, you know, bonkers over Tim Holtz, and so do I. I like the products, I really do, but I was Kane Company first. She was first in my world, in my life. Look at this. Somebody listens. Somebody must listen to me because tulips, oh my goodness, one of my favorite flowers, and butterflies. More napkins. I'm going to be, I'm going to have like, na ooh, I'm going to have the best collection of napkins. After this haul, I'm trying to work it out in the plan that everybody gets at least like 40 different, hopefully different, um, patterns. Because we all shop a lot of the same places and we may have some duplicates, but look at our cute. Pokey dot napkins. I like napkins. Who would have thunk that you could be so happy about napkins? What the heck is this? It's some ephemera. Look at how pretty. That's cool stuff to cut out and use. Cool stuff. This is somebody's photograph. Look, it has like, this is what my grandma's handwriting looked like, I swear. It's got like grandma handwriting on the back. Ooh, smash pad with all the, I want to cut this so you can see them. Smash book, look, journal, journal cards, fun little, the whole stack of them. That's super cool. Okay, what next? Oh my gosh, I love embossed papers. Embossed papers, can you see the embossing? I'm trying to get the light right. Oh, cute, cute, cute. This... Is this meant to be stuck to this? This is meant to be stuck to this. Okay, I think. It's really hard to tell. I don't want to pull it apart if it's supposed to go together. So on this side, it feels like leather and it's all bumpy and cool. And then on the other side is painted canvas. Painted canvas. If these are not meant to be stuck together, Gina, you give me a call and let me know because they're stuck together and it seems like they were cut together so I'm guessing they go together. I want to rip them and break them. More, okay, so I don't know where all this comes from and how you acquired them, but this is really cool. This is just a stack, I mean, a mess, a mess of really cool old photographs. A mess of them. Where do you guys get this stuff? I don't have this stuff. I mean, I don't have old pictures like this. Like, where do you guys find these things? Because the stuff that Jennifer sent me was, like, legitimate photos of people she didn't know from other places. And, and Where do you guys get this stuff? Oh, my goodness. What is that? Oh, oh. I'm saving this. I'm saving that because it's the biggest thing in the box. We're saving it for last. Oh, I actually need these. <laughs> How perfect is that? How perfect is that? This looks like a little pack of pop dots and some tabs. And I like, I need these actually for my for my planner. Thank you. Thank you, how'd you know? Oh, look at how cute. Are you serious? These are... <laughs> Gina... Gina made earrings. Look at these. Okay, this is a bottle um, cap. Those flattened out bottle caps I thought were so amazing that I got in another stash, I think, from Quincy. Um, and Gina made them into earrings. Those are so cute. I'll have to wear those. I'm going to have to wear those. 
it's like um it's like art enjoy i have plans to make jewelry out of my art i actually have some stuff i just haven't done it yet because i get so distracted by so many other things that i could be doing that I'm, and i'm not doing the things that i that I, I, have, I need more hours in the day. Does anybody else need like a 48 hour day and no sleep? That's what I need. Oh, pretty. Aren't they pretty? I'm going to wear them for the rest of this video. They're just the right length. Like they just, they, they're like just the right length with my hair. Perfect. Thank you so much. Those are handmade. I don't know if I've had a pair of handmade earrings that I didn't make. So we got one more painted card. This is nice and hard painted card. And a jelly. Look at this. It's beautiful. It is utterly stunning. I, I might have to, like, just suck it up and buy the jelly plate, right? Maybe. If I ever run out of jelly prints that you guys have sent me that I, and I need more, I may suck it up. Otherwise, I'm going to just keep using yours. So, <laughs> I haven't opened it, so I don't know exactly what's in it, but but I'm guessing it's, it's an art journal. Look at this. What is this cover? Is this canvas? Canvas, denim. It is painted fabric of some sort. I'm not sure which because paint makes it stiff. So it could be denim, denim, it could be canvas. And it's sewn with about a gazillion signatures. You see all that? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Now, how does this open gently? I see how. I see how to open it. So we just I'm dying. Okay, let's see. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. What did I... Oh, you're a smarty pants, aren't you? Okay, Gina, you're my hero. Mm -hmm. Gina Ahrens is my hero. I have now stated it publicly. Because she's a smarty pants. Okay, so she made me an art journal. She made me an art journal. But this is really cool. So, I'm trying to, like, rest it. Okay. So, these are all, and it's more of these. It's all these paint samples, right? But you turn one page, and then the next page is a flip out. What do you think of that? And each one is individually sewn in. Yeah, and that's why there's about a gazillion of those strings on the back. Because she made each one its own little individual signature and they all have these flip outs oh my gosh like for reals this is my hero did i say that already i repeat myself gina aarons is my hero so and some of these have photographs like this butterfly for crying out loud i could just leave the butterfly and like journal around it because it's gorgeous but yeah all these flip outs and was I not just saying that I needed a new journal? Didn't I just say I wanted a new journal to um, use Crazy Island Family ephemera in that you guys sent me? This might be it. This might be it. I don't know. I actually ordered a journal. Don't hate me. I have no self-control. I really don't. This is such a cute little charm. I'm so, I'm so drawn to this journal. It's killing me. I love it so much so much and I'm praying that this is one that you had made and sitting around your studio and that you did not make this in your post-surgery should be recovering state working with one hand because I don't see how you can make this with one hand but if you did like you're my hero times 12 because there's no way this is so cool so this might be it I don't know it's the perfect size right like it's a perfect little small journal I love it not too small because I couldn't go I couldn't I, I'm scared of my ATCs. I haven't even started them because the size terrifies me. I did break down and buy some because I just because I just didn't feel like <laughs> cutting my own watercolor paper. It's lazy, I know, but I swear my my paper cutters never cut straight. So um, I went ahead and I bought some watercolor paper ones because my other ones that I picked up at Tuesday morning were so flimsy. So at the art store, I did get some watercolor ones. Um, on watercolor paper so it's nice and thick and strong and it will stand up to what I want to do to it what I think I want to do to it who knows and considering everything that everyone has sent me I have a lot of papers and I have a lot of painted papers and I have a lot of cute little ephemeras I may be using some of those if they're the right theme for spring um hang on I need the water 
So I might be using some of those for my ATCs. I'm not sure. So then like Crazy Island Family stuff could be like all over the place, right? So thank you beyond words to both of you ladies, Miss Letha and to Gina. You guys are so generous. So generous to send me this stuff. My happy mail is going to pale. Pale in comparison to some of the stuff that you have sent me. I have a bunch of them that I need to send out that I haven't even got together. I have gotten so far as to get the envelopes. Five. I have five envelopes. So five people are getting something first and then I'll have to work on it because, um, you know, I'm going to run out of money. Because shipping is going to kill me. But that's okay. I will, I will figure it out. I'll figure it out. I need to get another class up so I can earn a little more money so I can have some shipping money to send stuff out. <laughs> so that's, that's where I'm headed, right? Um, I thank you guys so, 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 so much. I, I can't even say how much I appreciate all of the kind things that you guys have sent me. And um, Gina, this journal, like, I got... I have like, I have a thing for books too. I have a thing for a lot of things, but books, and now I have two. I have two, and a squeaky chair, I'm sorry. I have two. One that I will not journal, and one that I most definitely will. You're such a smarty pants. I can't get over what a good idea it is to use these things. So, if y'all were looking for an idea for a journal, this is perfect. Like, this is cardstock. It's hard. So, it's going to stand up to what I do. I know I'll have to gesso it because it's a little shiny, but it's not any more glossy than the Hannah Montana book. So, I don't think it's going to be a problem. I'm ready. I'll collage. I'll gesso. I'll do something. I'm going to have a great time playing with that. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. I have my pretty little pink earrings on. And um, I may wear these out the next time we go out to dinner. Somebody will ask me about them. Somebody will, and I, I, I wish I had a business card for you, Gina. I will put a piece of paper with your, um, I'll show these, with your website on it. There's Gina's website. If you like her jewelry or her stuff in general, check out her website because she made these earrings obviously with the intention to sell them because she's got a price tag on the package. So that means if you like her stuff and you want to check out what she's got, check it out. Gina Aarons, is that what it says? Gina Aarons.com. Gina B. Aarons. Gina B. Aarons.com. Go check her out. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Letha, I don't think you have do videos or anything yet. But if you do, tell me and I'll like I'll, I'll figure out a way to pop it in here later. Um, thank you ladies so much. Thank you Yvonne for the beautiful postcards. Such a cute little map of Australia. I really liked it. I love everything so much, and I can't get over how great you guys are to me. <laughs> You're so generous. And um, be on the lookout for that, no, napkin swap. We're going to try and keep it affordable, maybe do it a couple of times. That way it won't get too expensive in the shipping for some of you. So um, be prepared for that. If you don't own any napkins, maybe you should start looking for some. If you want to be a part of the swap, it's going to be fun. Like I said, a lot of us buy a bunch of packages and then, you know, what are you going to do with 30 of the same napkins? So this is our way of kind of trying to work that out. So I hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend. My weekend just got better. I'm going to go hang out on the couch with my husband again. Uh, as soon as I get this video edited and out and uploaded for you guys, then I'm going to hang out for the rest of the weekend because I already have my next video ready to go for tomorrow to show you my Tim Holtz collection portfolio. And I'm working on some others, so I'm going to be editing this weekend to get some other videos. i got the Hannah Montana one coming out. And I have one I made while I was still recovering on the couch. It's a creating on the couch using like mostly Montana markers and a bunch of ephemera out of Kelly's pack that she sent me. She was one of my first Happy Meals and I got all excited and I started just creating using stuff out of her pack. And I never got the video edited her up, so I'm going to work on that. So um, y'all will see me because I have stuff ready to go, but I may not be making new videos. I may be all editing this weekend, so um, maybe next week I'll get back to work. But you won't know that because you'll see work. See, smart sometimes. Sometimes I got it together. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend, and I will see you all later. Bye.